Connie Ferguson interview with Confidenti How do you juggle your roles as an actress, businesswoman, wife and mother? Connie Ferguson, I have help. I am not in denial because I am no superwoman. Laughs. Namibian women are faced with so many challenges. Is there anything you would want to share with them? Connie Ferguson, realize your beauty from the soul and never let anyone take that away from you. Be true to yourself. You are not alone, be strong and continue fighting. Who are your role models? Connie Ferguson, my mother, before anyone else. I know what we have been through and we managed. I am so grateful for everything she has done for me and my siblings that I make it a point to fully support her. The wild just ended. Are you considering going back to Generations? Connie Ferguson, I love Generations and I was torn apart when I left. My fans want me to return to the soapy. Though I am not sure, never say never. Carabo fans love her and the fact that the character is not dead is something to look into. What do you do for fun? Connie Ferguson, laughs. You won't believe it but I watch movies. My husband, the children and I are obsessed about TV series. We like to sit down as a family and just watch television together. Meanwhile the empowerment can fear NCETH a T saw at least two five zero women from diverse backgrounds attend, was held under the theme, Women Embracing Brilliance and was organized by businesswoman and president of Women of Substance, Lisa, Isabella, Horaiha Pauses. The conference saw other South African experts, entrepreneur, Robin Wheeler, high altitude mountaineer, Dish Handisal and motivational speaker, Dr. John Ty Bain, tackle personal, corporate and economic challenges faced by women and shared developing personal values, financial know-how and career coaching. No matter what challenges we face, we have to ensure that we reach the top, said Dissel, who climbed the world's tallest mountains in 31 countries. Women have not moved from liberation to leadership. Women should co-create the world with men. It is either you are on the table or on the menu. There has got to be a shift, said Dr. Ty Bain, who abandoned his medical doctor's career to inject people with wisdom. Hawes said, women are people we learn from on a daily basis but they are not given the chance to exude potential. We need to try to bring women onto the platform and to allow them to unleash their potential.